Good morning. This is the Outdoor Artist. It's the 11th of May and it's the day to start on filling in the sand trap that's been under construction here for well it's been it's been dug uh, a year and a half ago I guess and so you can see the excavation and uh, fabric liner so step number one is going to be to take a blower and just blow all the debris out of that. This tarp is simply to uh, catch any stray sand that happens to fall coming down. And the method is going to be shoveling sand into the uh, trusty toboggan. The, used for quite a few different projects here. So, uh, very nice day to, for this kind, of a, this kind of work, and we'll see how it goes. This is about three tons of uh, nice bunker sand that I was able to get from a local supplier. So, more to come, but here's the setup. This is the Outdoor Artist, signing off for now. Hi, Outdoor Artist here. I'm back. It's three hours later and the sand trap is, for all intents and purposes, completed. That's, uh, for those of you doing the math, that's about a ton an hour of sand. There's some shaping to do still and some, uh, got to put in a lip and that kind of thing. But uh, for the most part, it's uh, completed and I'm pleased with how it looks. Now there hasn't been a single shot taken from the trap yet. It's like getting a new car, you know, you just don't want to drive it. But probably by tomorrow, I'll hit a couple out of here up onto the green, which is waiting. I have to admit that the toboggan lasted about 45 minutes before I looked up at my Massey Ferguson loader and thought, hmm, this might be an intelligence test. So once I brought the loader on the scene, things went a lot more quickly, which is why I'm done three hours later versus three days later. So hats off to Massey Ferguson for helping me out there. Tomorrow I'll mow the green and water the green. But right now, everything's looking good. And this is the outdoor artist. Signing off.